This short video will guide you to the installation and how to operate the rotating work table using the G20 fiber laser systems by Hans Laser and the accessories that are sealed and packed inside this box and they are consist of the control box rotating work table for your circular or marking projects two locking keys for the job power plug two molex connectors and two serial connectors I'm going to demonstrate on how to install the rotating work table on the G20 as well as the control box and all other accessories and how to operate and set up using the Hans Laser software. First, you will need a screwdriver in order to connect the serial connectors to the back of the system. The 37 pin connectors on the bottom and the 9 pin are to be securely tightened in the back of the system. As is shown in the video, 37 pin goes on the bottom and the 9 pins goes on top. At this point, connect the power cord from the control box and to the AC outlet. Then insert the two sets of Molex connectors into the slot and to be connected to the work table connectors. As it's shown on the video, Connect the Molex connectors into the rotating work tables. Set aside and away from the beam pad. Now, there are actually a few ways to secure the materials into the rotating work tables. You can either insert the materials into the chop or outside the chop depending on the sizes of the materials. And it will be shown in this video. Now when all the connectors are connected and the rotary work table is mounted in its place, You may now switch on the control box, making sure that the indicator light turns on. Now from the laptop, open the operating software, then click on the following, Setup, Switch Software, click on the text box and center it. Then enter the desired words. Click on the enable box and choose the marking pattern. 
then set the distance, click apply. Now right click on the text box and choose convert to line F. Click yes. Right click the text box again and at this time choose add to single object. Then on the right control icons choose the symbol that says ungroup. Now highlight each letter and on the right icons choose the symbol that says group. Do run every letter from the text input. Now let's proceed to setting up the beam path. Click on the upper window that says mark icon, the box will appear. Click on the red box, then close it. And on the upper right hand icons, choose the focus icon. Then on the box, choose focus, then close it. Now on the objects to be marked, shows two red dots. Bring the two dots together by manually rotating the beam adjustment pulley from the, for a beam optimization. Observe until you see the two beams becomes one, then close the focus window. Now click on the setup and choose the icon that says rotate mark for marking command. And on the box, enter the diameter size in millimeter. Then click OK. Then on the final setup, click on the circular icon. Close the safety window of the G20, then click start. Markings will proceed immediately. At this point, you may now enjoy your G20 Fiber Lasers marking system and its rotating work table by Hans Laser Corporation. Good luck on your next project!